Uh, my name is Sandy Edward and I'm 24 years old. Before I got a sponsorship, I was staying with my, my grandpa, but then is that a time reached when my grandpa couldn't pay for my school fees, you know. Because from, uh, from the family that I come from, it's not that much well off. This is a family which cannot even afford two meals a day. I remember you could only like have one meal once in a day. If at all, we are blessed to have that meal. I could go out and do some jobs, I would go to mines, looking for jobs to do, sand mines, stone mines, struggling with life to survive. Then one day, I was moving around the village, then I saw children seated down that tree. But when I reached there, near them, they are having some classes, and I was like, ah, now these people are so lucky, these children are so lucky, why can't I be like them? Then, immediately after when I said that, there's a lady who was called uh, Lydia. That Lydia, she was the one managing that school. And that is the New Foundation Primary School. New Foundation Primary School was, was still under construction. They were putting, just putting buildings and classes were under the tree. And she was like, you want to have education? And I was like, yes. She said, it's okay. Tomorrow you come and start with education. I jumped. I felt so happy. I felt like even fainting. I was extremely happy. I was in a day section. I could move from home to the school, but it was quite a long journey. It was like three kilometers. And at my age, it was really, it was really so hard. Because I remember I had some old shoes. Some were torn here, just around here. And one was fine could put on my turn shoes, move my car distance, which was really not okay for me. That's when I met Anita among that those people who came, that first team that came in 2007. Then after after that time they were that to go back to UK. And that's when she told me that you know what, Sand, I'm going to start paying for you school fees. I jumped. This is the thing I didn't expect in my life. I felt so happy. I felt that my dreams are, are coming true. Because all, all my dream was to study. All my dream was to become an accountant. So when I passed away, I, uh, I went for, for a degree in business administration, majoring in accounting. So after my degree, I'm going to get a good job for my family. At least I'm going to, I know by God's grace I'm going to make a difference in my life, my family. At least I want to give a hand to someone. I want to give a hand to that person down there starving with life like me. I want to change someone who's just who has just who's just like me, how I was. Please keep helping people, keep helping another Sunday who's down there starving with life. I'm not what I ought to be or I'm not what I, I may wish to be. But because of Anita, because of other ministry, I'm not what I was. I 